Hello guys, welcome to windowsreport.com. In this video we're going to talk about another BSOD error, which is the kernel security check failure. So this error could uh, come up in two ways. The first way would be that you receive this BSOD and you cannot open your windows. Or the second way is that you can open your windows, but once uh, you open it and you use it, you'll get this BSOD. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to solve this BSOD if your windows is still working and if you can still access your windows if your windows is not accessible you have to go in the description there we have an article that gives you solutions for that part as well The first solution would be to update all your drivers. This BSOD could come up from various parts of your components, maybe from your RAM memory, maybe from your motherboard. It could be from a lot of parts. In the article down below, you'll have a link to this page, which is a tool that will download all the Windows 10 latest drivers. Don't worry, it also works on Windows 8 and Windows 8.1. You just have to download this app, you run it, and you see if your Windows has some outdated drivers or even doesn't have drivers for certain parts and once you do that you should be up and running but if the problem is still persisting you should try the upcoming solutions the second thing you should try is to fully scan your system for viruses there are multiple types of viruses that can cause this BSOD so be very careful use a program that is recommended by windowsreport.com you can find links in the article down below of course and you can also try multiple variations you can scan your windows with windows defender and with other third party apps if you want the third method would be to repair your drives using your windows and this is a very easy thing to do just have to access your computer you have to click on the search box and here you write this PC then you click here up top on this PC as you can see this is my PC I have only a partition but if you have more you have to do these steps for all your partitions you have to left click on your partition then properties then you have to click on the tools tab and then you have to click on check so your Windows operating system will automatically make a scan of your partition will check for errors for corrupted files and the problem should be solved if you don't have time to make this for all your partitions it's very recommended to make it at least for your Windows partition because from there most of the BSODs error come from and also you can click on optimize and the windows will start the defragmentation of the drive so guys these steps that I shown you are very good to fix this issue but don't forget if there is a hardware failure of the hard drive or the RAM memory in your device you'll most likely have to change it with a new one so if you have any additional questions regarding this subject please don't hesitate to leave a comment on YouTube here or even on the article down below and as I said don't forget to check out the article because there we have a lot more solutions and some solution for those of you that can't access the windows anymore after this BSOD so this was the video for today guys until next time have a nice day